All right. Let's watch this one more time here. And may the Christian Lord guide my hand against your Roman popery. It's super cool. I really, really, really like it. It's very, very cool. And may the Christian Lord guide my hand against your Roman popery. All right, so I'm gonna start with the guy on the left, since that's the least, least in quotation marks. Amount of work. Um, go down in volume. I just love the hands. Yay! <laughs> Actually, if you want to be super picky, which I can see your eye roll from here, even though this starts earlier, this black hand here, it does feel like they both come down at the same time. And you can probably offset that a bit more. Super cool. It'd be so awesome. It was filled with all kinds of guys in the background. Anyway, I think the, <clears throat> the volume, the breathing is great. It all works. I buy it. I'm a bit concerned at how quickly this snaps here. This is such a linear boom. Where I will probably give this at least one more frame of ease out of there. It's just, it's really, really snappy. It just takes all, you know, like the thing is, the way they all move, that step there, and how the arms go down, and all of this, all defines the weight and style of this shot. And then you get to this, and this kind of betrays that style, and the, the weight you've established. So that's just a bit harsh to me. How the hold and the settle and all the interactions of is great. It's my dog, by the way. He is howling at that frame. <laughs> Boom! You know, it has a good feel to it, but again, all of the rest is all weighty. So that this moment there just does not quite fit. Just a bit too much. Watch out, I think this hand pops a bit at the end. Watch it, watch it, watch it, and boop. It's not a pop, but it's like a, it's a weird, just kind of a translates, kind of a ra not a random thing. It just feels like it doesn't really need it. My dog really has something. It just, but I don't see that pullback in the body actually. Let's go back here. Yeah, it's just kind of there. I mean, I guess are you doing it because of the shake at the end? I don't know, it seems like I'll probably just take that out. Not have that in there. It would be neat during this breathe in and all that stuff you have here. To feel something in here. Like he's so loose that like this hand would slightly roll over a bit. Especially through all of this here, right? Just something a bit looser. Which this one has, that's nice. I buy all this. Should be all good. And I wonder, let's go back, maybe not, I'm just wondering if as you grab him here, there might be like a slight change, I don't know if that's going to miss you, or if it's like an IK hip you have, but to get that line a bit different through here, something where, it's not like he takes a step or something, I mean I'm not going to go that far, but there's something about this section through down here, you know, not really doing anything. I'm just looking at his belly type of thing, and then there's so much going on with grabbing his head and moving him forward or something that I feel like it would do something a bit more down here. It's about it's about that for this guy. Now on the other one. And may the Christian Lord I think when you have, starting on like detail thing, that's not that important, but watch out that your fingers don't move all at the same time. And they kind of pop down and then it kind of stay put. So like you want to, on the way up here, continue a bit of that squeeze and then open up the way you have it here and potentially 
on that end and roll out this finger just a bit more. It's just a bit more detail on the fingers. The I just I feel the pose to pose. Like the the popping and posing. And may the Christian Lord guide my hand. And may the Christian Lord guide And may the Christian Lord guide my hand. And may the Christian Lord guide my hand against your ro And may the Christian yeah, another thing is, it, not that it's wrong, but you see how at the very beginning this arm, like nothing moves through here, and it sounds like this is part of a longer speech. And may the Christian I believe he says "and" at the beginning, so it almost feels like you want to start the way you have it here because you don't want to get too close. But throughout the thing before the move with his hands, you want to go actually what I did here. You want to go from this line up to this line, right? Because he goes, and like the way he says it here. And may the Christian. And may the Christian. So, like, like, the energy goes up and then explodes, right? And may the Christian. Like, on crystal would be an accent. So, to me, it feels like as he says this, he's preparing for this accent, and you could show that in bringing this arm up a little bit. Like, uh, bam, like a little up and then whip. And may the Christian Lord die. That's for that. And, may the and then during and may, there's nothing going on in the head here. And may the you know, it's basically just jaw. See that? That's a massive jaw move. So you want to have, to me, like as it goes down, you would have like a slight arc either way. But to me, it was like this way. If the nose tip will go, so the head will go down and over a bit. Boom! And on this, it will go up a bit and then go back down a bit. Like some something. I think the May, the down on the May is a frame or two too early. And may the Christian Lord. Hold on. And may the Christian And may the Christian Lord. And I think you can keep it down a bit longer. Just and May. And May. See how it just it just goes down and then stays the same high pretty much. So it would be here, here maybe not as much. And then this, and then one more, and keep it open a bit longer. And may the Christian Lord guide my Does he crystal lore? I don't know what he says, but let's pretend it's crystal. And may the Christian Lord May the Chris May the May the you, know, it's, you don't have to go down uh, back in so much here. And may the Christian Lord And may the Christian But the main thing is that the May is a bit too early and it snaps and locks too much. Let's move that out. And may, the and may and May could have, imagine this point would have a little arc this way, like a little jaw arc. And, may the Christian and, may the Christ and I think with that frame that you're going down too early, you can hold the M a bit longer. And the thing is, right now it just closes the mouth, but there's no mmm, there's no roll in of the lips. And may the so you do want to feel the May. In the moment where you know the lips are down, are closed. Here, imagine from here to here, like it wouldn't go down as much, but the lips would still be closed. Imagine, like, you know, imagine you close the lips, you close your mouth, mm, and now you open the jaw mm, while the lips are still closed. You do want to feel that and see that in here. And may the Christian Lord guide my hand against your Roman popery. The rest is actually pretty good. I like it. And may the Christian Lord guide my hand. And may the Christian Lord guide my hand. I, I think even on guide, it's like your jaws are a bit sharp. Lord guide my hand. And may the Christian Lord guide my hand against your Roman popery. Yeah, this is great. Hold on. And may the Christian Lord guide. My yeah. Guide my hand. Against your Roman popery. Eyes are good. And may the Christian. And may the. So to to me it feels like going back to what I said before. And on the end I will probably have like a slight squeeze, slight little frown, and then open. And may the. And may and on the end go in and may and then open. May the Christian Lord. And may the Christian Lord.
And then just a bit, it's not going to be the full thing. It was like that, I will keep what you have here. But it feels like you're hitting the maximum here in the eyebrows. And you usually want to go here, and then one, two, three, four, five, continue. Maybe this line will be up here. So it's, it hits, but it kind of, you know, fleshy as so the verb to flesh, fle fleshes, fleshes up a bit more. May the Christian Lord guide my and then, so it's crystal up, and then Lord, imagine Lord, it goes from this to a bit more in, not super sad, but then you get those scrunchy things, so the eyebrows go in a bit, so you do have a bit of a change in eyebrows, it's not just up, and then that's it, like I don't see anything through here. The Lord, guide my hand! And then, same thing here, guide my hand, there's nothing going on in there, the eyebrows. Lord, guide my hand! I my again guide my on my can go in and then hands open up again. Hand against your Roman. And then on that big turn, to soften that a bit. I mean, it's, it is very fast. It, it it's the very linear key. I will give this one more frame, and go be from here to here, and then go sharp the way you have it. It's just a bit too linear, and then two frames before I would. You have it slightly, the eyebrow down, but I will make this frame or two earlier and b bigger. You want to see it, this is more of a feeling, I want to see it. My hand against your Roman popery! Because that way will also soften the turn without losing its snappiness. But something else is already moving and changing, then this turns. Against your Roman popery! And against your Roman and then Roman again has nothing in the head as this is a massive move here so this could be another one where the nose does like a down to the left turn because of the jaw doing the same thing like it the jaw does a little arc and pulls the head with it against your Roman popery not to be crazy but it also will also help with the accent there against your Roman popery and then on Popery. Against your Roman Popery. Sounds like Potpourri. Popery. Against your Roman Popery. That, I like what you have here, but what you could do is. Bum bum. Two frames. Actually, a Y rotation this way. So the nose is here. And then, boom, on this, the nose would end up being here. And then three frames later, it might be back to here. So a bit of a, like a head shake, left, right. It's subtle, but a bit more of an explosion. Roman popery. Just a bit more right now. It's pow. And on that explosion through here, the nose kind of locks. See so through all of this, and you want to keep that just a bit more alive. With like a slight little left, right. Roman popery. It's your Roman popery. The earrings are great. Are they... And may the Christian Lord guide my hand against a Roman popery. Actually, it would be really cool if, you know, if you do the whole eyebrow thing and you keep just go one more frame, but you, otherwise you keep that snappiness just for a frame or two that ear will drag. And then as you stop here on that frame, the ear comes forward a bit. Super subtle. This would be really adds, adding some fleshiness. But so much on the on the edge of feeling. You don't really want to see it, but you want to feel something just a bit. Just tiny, tiny, tiny. And against your Roman popery. And you could experiment if this thing has uh, nose control, uh, ear controls every time. You know, but you have such a huge amount of down and up with some squishiness here that every time you go up like this, you could also bring up the ears a bit. You can start adding some... You know when you smile, you go back with the corners and the ears go up? You can incorporate some of that stuff here. Especially through this. Big moves like this where the head is not doing much, even though you would add, hopefully, some other accents in there. That jaw up and down could still influence some stuff here. So you can really feel how the fleshiness is not just here, but it really influences that part of the skin and the ears. Roman popery. And one last thing there. And against your Roman popery. 
And I feel like this is a bit too wiggly on, on the last... Against your Roman Popery! Right there, I think it's... I like this, but I wouldn't come back as much. Because you have so much tension here, but then this is so loose that it kind of fights that. So I would go out on that accent, but then go back maybe only this much, and then that's it, and then go back to the right again. So it's a, it's a tense moment on, in his arm. Against your Roman Popery! You know, because if, if you look at the end, it just it just swings all the time. Against your Roman Popery! You know, swing, and then it would be and stay there a bit, left, right, a little tense moment. Against your Roman Popery! Be awesome if this would move. <laughs> but yeah, that is it. It's a fantastic piece. Being picky here, you know, good stuff that you want to add. Basically, add some character. Oh yeah! All right, thanks. All right. There's an email. You can sign up. You can start whenever you want. You can submit whenever you want. You get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right. Thank you.